Well, shit. What are y'all doing? This, this is awful. awful. I'm Deontay. I'm Jordan. And today we are here giving you our uh, review to The Suicide Squad, uh, the reboot from the uh, 2016, 2016 Suicide Squad. Um, you know, like we always start out. Uh, what did you What did you think about it? No, we don't have to start out that way this time because it's both of our first time seeing it. So what did you think? So I enjoyed this Suicide Squad just like I enjoyed the other one. They both were enjoyable movies. This one is obviously a better movie. Uh, the, the subplot, the the interactions they had the, the when they were trying to be funny it was actually funny like everyone understood their assignment the way they handled blood sport uh his weapon his gadgetry he was cool like what was all of them pieces that he took like off his suit to make a weapon i don't know what it was but it was clean as it was cool as hell like everybody did the polka dot man the, even the weird little rat chick or whatever everybody. both of them stories was weird their whole oh, character yeah, the, whole, the polka dot the man mom, the and mama, yeah, like the, the way... mommy issues and then the girl and the rats and <laughs> like the whole rat them thing. trying to make it like a real deep story like these are rats we're talking about <laughs> like chill out <laughs> it is not this many rats in this city yo <laughs> I mean, no, I know, but I'm saying from. like the feeling, the emotion they were trying to provoke yeah, they thought over we, some rats. They thought we was going to get sad when he was like, the rats are the lowest. Boy, we don't care about none of that shit. You yeah. could have chose the monkeys or something. I know that. <laughs> rats. But anyway, so uh, what do you think about Amanda Waller? She lost her shit in this movie, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> she did that girl had to clock her ass. Like, did she hit her with the, with, with the crutch? I don't even what? know what that was. <laughs> It looked like a golf club or yeah, something. I don't know, I don't know why they like, had that. I, like, also, they she had, was about to kill everybody, yeah, though. That, she was not going to hold nothing back. Like, the the way that they sent them in there, we were thinking that they were actually, like, trying to... They were just trying to get those records. Right. It was like, you was bullshitting the whole time, acting like this was something, like, dangerous. Like, it was dangerous shit. It was. And what, wait, but were they going to get exposed? Like, why was it so important uh, to her to get those files right because, now? Because, because... The peep the the current the current government that was there, uh -huh. remember they hung all those people, and then the mil those military people kind of took over. So oh oh oh, that's so they right. made the deal with them. So now that's why they were like, oh shit, the people that we was making deals with not in charge no more. Mm -hmm. We gotta go get that shit out of there. Okay, I see. So, but, but yeah, again, but was... that was brilliant though. Like I that was in you know that uh -huh. was an actual plot. It made sense. It was. That was a like I'm saying like the writing in this movie was fantastic, mm -hmm. the action like everything about this movie was, like was 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 great. I, I got no complaints. I can't. I'm not really a fan of Harley Quinn to be quite honest. You're not what You're... the whole dumb girl, stupid like humor type. Eh, I don't be feeling it. Yeah, you know, yeah. You know, what was uh, it's too much? Is it getting too it's, much? Yeah, it's a little too much. Like I, I, I I'm. A... The whole they spent the whole five minutes on the whole Milton thing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they brought it back too. Like right. they, it, it was two scenes. There was too many Milton scenes. Yes, right? It was too yes. many. It was but a lot. I, I like I actually like the way she plays the character. Like I, I got no complaints from Harley. Mm. I got no complaints. I like the beginning when they you know, we thought that that was the actual mission, the team, but mm -hmm. it was she was actually using them as like a distraction bait, bait. basically, because all of them got they sliced got up in and, the beginning. But what did I tell you before? The, I said all these people here are here just they're to die. just here just to die. Like none of these people are gonna have any significance in this movie. It's too right. many of them, so they were just placed to die. And I like the way all of them died too. <laughs> I was kind of sad for Captain Boomerang too, because he was in the last one. And them, was, oh, sorry, go ahead. No, I'm saying, but I like I like that movie, so I was kind of sad to see uh, Captain Boomerang die. Them kills in the beginning, though, they came out swinging. Like, the way that uh, Pete the Davis's Davidson face. Got, just got, and then the dude head got sliced by Boomerang. By Boomerang, yeah. Ooh, like, look, like I'm saying, the kills in the the, the, the the movie was shot beautiful. Like, the CGI was not bad. Mm -hmm. Well, the rat CGI was a little funky. It was a little wonky, you know, uh, at, towards the end. Because, again, ain't that many rats in one place. <laughs> it's not that many rats. Maybe there is. What if there is? That's disgusting That's... to think about. We not gonna think about it. All right, you mean to tell me that girl can come shine a light in here? And... Yeah, she ain't even gonna like. Why the heck like like anybody can't just get the the one and turn the light right? on? Right, she's not a superhero. She's not like... a superhero. She did not deserve to be. The rats did I still all the like work. Egypt. 
I ain't gonna lie, man. EJ Elvis is a cool ass dude, bro. He, everything he do, he just be cool as hell. Like every hundred percent agree. You know, I mean, I ain't even gonna hate. I ain't like you. See, like if this was Scarlett Johansson, you'd be hating right now. I'm giving him his props. Why are you bringing her up? Because that's how you did. You did not that. Not even in all, this movie. All, all through Winter Soldier, all you did was talk about her. Because I don't like her. Okay then. So fuck, fuck Idris Elba. Fuck him. Wow. <laughs> no, wow. I'm just, no, I'm just playing. <laughs> I don't mean that. I'm not like her. But anyway, I, we actually enjoyed uh, Suicide Squad. Mm -hmm. I would give it like, I'm, I would give it like an eight, solid eight. It was good. I liked it. I really enjoyed it, and I I'll would watch it again. Eight. And I would watch it again. We'll go with an eight. Like, all right. So, and that's all we have. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Tell us what you thought. Did you enjoy the movie? Uh, did you go to the movie theaters and see it, or did you watch it at home like we did on A3 or Max? I can never go to the movie theater again. Oh, uh, you've been spoiled? I've been spoiled watching brand new movies in the comfort <laughs> of our own home with subtitles yes. and being able to pause when I have to use the bathroom or get more snacks. Like, how can we go back to going out into the movie theater? Like, Sorry, AMC. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, but that's going to be it for us. Uh, Y'all have a good day and be safe.